All right, welcome back. Uh, so in this how to blender video, we're going to do a simple outline. Um, there is a way to do it with an eaves, uh, but we're going to do this with uh, a grease pencil so that we can have it work in both cycles or uh, eave and make our life easier. Uh, so yeah, let's get started. Let's add a material. Um, we're just going to add some simple blue. Let's go to rendering. Actually, no, let's go here instead. Then we're going to create a collection. And this collection holds your uh, your mesh. So it could be just the simple cube or your entire model. So we're just going to call it mesh. Ah. Uh, put your cube in here for reference. And then we're going to add a new collection. This is where we're going to do our grease pencil. Um, so shift a grease pencil blank. Okay. And our material for this is going to be just outline material. Um, that's all the settings here are fine as is. Let's go to the object data properties. So we're going to turn off lights and we're going to call this outline. Then we're going to the grease pencils modifier properties and add a modifier and to be the line art right here okay and then we're going to choose our collection it's going to be our mesh we're going to choose our layer outline and then we're going to choose our outline material and there we have it it gets it pretty well you're going to see these edges here it doesn't get them uh, and we can use a little more uh, green pencil magic to work that out or you know, to make sure the outlines are there but overall we can increase the thickness like this to make it work oh this is based on like the outlines that you see is based on uh your camera so if we change the camera here uh let's go to n go to yeah Go to view camera lock and then we move things around the edges that we couldn't see before that had outlines will have them so take that into account before you go into grease pencil and do something like I'm going to show you right now so camera view off zero so here like without the camera you're not going to see any edges right so if you want to add edges but mistakenly uh what you can do is go to uh edit mode no go to your grease pencil here and go to draw mode and go here where it says stroke placement go to surface and we're going to go somewhere along 0 0.01 0 <sighs> Uh, five okay so that it's not too off the surface and then we're gonna use this right here Actually, let's increase the strength or opacity here and create a small figure and we see it that it comes off the mesh or the material if you place it too close you'll get you get some errors, so try not to put it too close to to your surface. Uh, but like I said, if you see that, hey, um, when you look at it from the render or the material view, that it doesn't have this edge, and you try to put this outline right here, like, yeah, it'll look nicer now, but again, it's really based on your camera view. So instead of like hey i want to change this up and add them you can be like okay let me look at from the camera view and i can just add maybe some little what's it called some little lines here or there to make it look fancier or to give it that kind of feel that you want all right so right like that uh, and then you can decrease the line thickness like 
is. So that line that you added, it's going to look weird uh, when you don't realize that it's based on the camera, your outline. Um, let's see, let's take this off for a second, press zero. What else can we do here, show you? Mm. Oh, that's right. The biggest thing, because we want an outline based on either the render engine Eve or cycles, and we go to cycles, it's still there, it's still working. And yeah, that's that's what matters. All right, uh, hope that helped. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, uh, post something in the comments.